Hello, I'm Seville 850 and I'm back today with another Division video. Today I'm making a build video on a high-end build. It's soon to be exotic pieces. These are uh, named gear set pieces and uh, let's get into it. Running a Fumas with the Savage Gloves. Savage Gloves give you the 16% extra damage. The Uncomplicated Talent on the Fumas gives you the 15% extra damage with no accuracy or stability. Uh, also running the Colonel Bliss Holster, which a lot of people don't know this about the Bliss Holster, that actually it's not just for pistol damage. Like, I'll use a 93R, get my stacks up, three round bursts so you fire three times into an enemy get your stacks up to nine that's 18 percent extra damage so then you can switch back to your famas and then you're getting 18 percent damage plus the 16 or 15 percent damage and then the 16 percent damage from your mc skull gloves that right there is a lot of extra damage uh running a barrett's bulletproof chest piece halfway decent one. It's not the best, but it's pretty darn good. Running the Pharaoh's Oxygen Mask. Helps pretty good in PvP. That's what I pretty much use this build for, but it, I also can use it for PvE. It works really well. This is primarily a DPS build. Uh, short Bow Championship Knee Pads. Uh, they're alright. They're not the best ones. I'd rather not have kill XP on them, but you know, you get what you got. Uh, I'm not running that stupid ninja messenger bike bag. That thing is such garbage. Has no use. Run specialized. Because then you get the extra skill power when you don't invest into any skill power. And then here I have the Thompson M192B28 from the uh, underground. <coughs> it's a pretty good one. It's not horrible, but it's fairly good I like it enjoy using it it's a fun gun to shoot sounds really nice uh, in a few I'll make a video on how to for sure get this Thompson in the underground it's just I played and played couldn't get it so I'll make a video on how you can get it uh, this is pretty much a Overall, fairly good build. I, I feel it'll be good for when 1.6 releases as a DPS build. It won't have much in the electronics, but can't really complain. It's not what I built this build for. Firearms is decent. Weapon damage, that's the that's for the uh, Thompson. Let's get the Fumas out here. And then go over to Weapon damage. Weapon damage 19,000. 19,500. Crit hit chance, not very high. Uh, crit hit damage, I run a lot of headshot damage. 100%. Uh, I like my headshots. Uh, see, no stability, no accuracy. It's a very controllable gun once you play with it for a little bit. A lot of people don't like it. But I'll tell you what, it is a dropper. I use it all the time and I have no issues with it. Uh, reload speed, no one really cares about that. Let's scroll on down here. Everyone wants to see your armor mitigation. Uh, my enemy armor damage is halfway decent. It's not the best. Alright, I've got 54.20% weapon mitigation. On my armor, that's a uh, that's halfway decent. The talents I am running, <coughs> I'm my abilities. I'm running a fire turret, booster shot, recovery link. Talents, critical save, of course. Wildfire, apply burn to any target, a 30% chance per each target in 10 meter radius. 
I like that for the flame turret. I like this one for the flame turret, tech support. Uh, kill a hostile with any skill is deployed to extend any active skill duration by 10%. So my turret lasts for a really long time in PvE. Uh, it works well in PvP too, you know, got that you set fire to a couple of people if they run into your turret chasing you, looping around a vehicle or whatever, doing the chicken dance. Uh, then this is a must-have when you run the short bow knee pads. I, in my opinion, you just can't run without it. Damage multiple hostiles with an explosion to apply 20% more damage from the blast. I have taken a frag grenade, thrown it at a group of rogues, and have laid them on the floor flat. So just keep in mind you have the short bow knee pads. You might want to run this chain reaction because in the DZ it works well. In PvE it is excellent in PvE. But you can drop a player with a frag grenade using this talent. So that is my build video on a high end build. Soon to be exotics. Uh hope you like it you know i love this build it's not my only build i'm about to post a couple of videos on a couple other builds that i have uh other than that see you later maybe i'll catch you in the dz slipping have a good day